Hello everyone, I welcome you to Akada Virtual Lab. Today there are two major things we want to achieve. The first we want to do is to see how we can use ChatGPT to generate content, to generate um, research questions for us, um, corresponding research objectives and hypotheses. And thereafter, we want to also use ChatGPT to set questions or to set standard questionnaire rather. Um, and to also format the same for us, which will make it ready for us to go to field. You know, to format the questionnaire and make it ready as we did it on the field. So let's see how we're going to go. So the first thing we want to do today is to uh, use an hypothetical example uh, in an hospital setting. For example, I have this question here. Um, I want to state and show ChatGPT that the types of my studies is as follows: assessing the effectiveness of the mobile health, MHS intervention in managing diabetes. This is just to improve ChatGPT about the title of my work. So thereafter, I'm going to request ChatGPT to set objectives for me and to also set corresponding uh, to set research questions and corresponding research objectives for me. So I have it here already to save our time. I'm going to uh, put this there. Box. So now, generate research questions and subjectives and hypotheses for the two. So let's see what I get to see. Ready to go, research questions. So look at this. How does the utilization of a mobile health intervention impact the safe management practices and health outcomes of individual with diabetes? That's the first one. The second one here is what are the key factors influencing the effectiveness? MS intervention in managing diabetes and now these factors again among the friendly brand. So you look at this, this is quite interesting. You don't have to be racking your brain about the questions to ask regarding your thesis, regarding the title of your work. This is what we have here. And if you look at the objectives, corresponding objectives also here. Then number one, which is answering the first question, which says how does socialization of MS intervention impact self-management practices? Now the objective is saying that to evaluate the impact of MS intervention on the self-management practices. Of individuals with diabetes, including medication adherence, dietary choices, and physical activity. Now, if you look at the second question elsewhere, it's asking about the factor influencing the effectiveness of the MS intervention. Look at that objective two is saying to identify and assess the factor that contributes to the effectiveness of the MS. ChatGPT is very perfect when you use rice products. Now, look at the corresponding hypothesis to the objectives. Now, hypothesis one, the use of MHF intervention will be positively correlated with improved self-management practices among individuals with diabetes, leading to better glycemic control and overall health outcomes. If you look at the corresponding hypothesis for the second one as well, it's also in line with what you have to do. So look, this is what you will have spent hours thinking about, racking your brain about. ChatGPT has assisted you to get it done in less than a minute. Okay, that's right. So thereafter, what do you then want to do? Want to create generate questions, you know, uh, related questions that we use for our, on our questionnaire um, as we go to the as we prepare to go to the field. So I have this here. Um, I'm going to ask ChatGPT to set standard relevant questionnaire to achieve the set objectives under research question one. You know. I want you to do that for question one, and I'm going to ask you to do the same for, for question two, as we see that we can make it really easy to begin on that. Ordinarily, the correct English here is set standard relevant questions. But I have experimented times with that number. Using the word questionnaire, we charge people to understand it better. So set standard relevant questionnaire to achieve the set of objectives under research question one. Charge people to understand what research question one is, is already in its memory. So let's go. Let's see what we're gonna have. All right? Can you see? It's giving us a social demographic characteristic for the demographics: age, what is your age, gender, male, female, other, educational level, high level, you know, and all of that. Employment. And this section two, which is the diabetes profile, type of diabetes, type one, type two. Can you see that? Duration of diabetes less than one year, one to five, and all of that. Can you see that section three? Mobile health intervention usually talking about the frequency of use. How long have you used it? Okay, this is fine. This is fine. This is fine. But then I'm going to ask ChatGPT now to now standardize the questionnaire apps app as appropriate. Because what I have here is not sufficient. But I'm going to ask ChatGPT to um, replace the bullet with um, let's say with this bracket. So let's see what we have. Okay. Okay. So can you see? Replacing that, replace the bullet with this. You see, you know, it's even giving me in the box, which is better than, than what I specified. You know, this is 
Bonga. You can see our age here. We are 18, 18 to 24, category 25 to 24. At the 5 to 24, and it's the second question on gender. Gender, male, female, other, and then educational level, high school, some college, and all of that. 14 employment, employed, you know, unemployed, students, retired, on that basis. You can see that. Because as it is, all you just need to do now is to copy and paste in your know, MS Whatever I'm going, I'm coming back to that. Let's come back to that. Let's come back to that. Can you see physical, physical activity? How often do you engage in activity? It's the activity that has done that. You can see that. You can see that here. So let me quickly do this. Let me quickly copy this now and see how we're going to put this in MS Word. But I think I want to do another thing first. I'd like to show you how to. I'm going to use another example now. Another example now to show like a type of thing. I think I have it there. The aspects where I like the ChatGPT to rate the level of satisfaction with the available to services using the five point like a Okay, this is to generate them. Let me ask it to generate, generate, generate the question. Let's Read the level to reach your level, the level of satisfaction with the available social services in a five point like that. So let's see what it does. Okay, that's fine. And you see, generated about eight segments. Number one is talking about um, general information, gender, made all of these are asking to the most. Just ask it to go from section two. Okay. I'm going to ask it to put this in the tabular form. Put this. Okay. From section two. From section two. Seven. Those are the ones with the same kind of rating. Strongly agree, disagree, disagree, neutral, agree, and other. So this one I'm going to use. I want to replace. I'm going to um, replace. The, include. Should be from one. From one right. Okay, so strongly okay. From strongly agree, that's done it by itself. So that's fine. So this is what I want. Okay, this is perfect. Then I'm going to ask you to replace this box by this angular bracket box. This is where I'm going. This is where I'm going. So I can also ask you to label out um, the items. One, over two. Dot, dot, okay. That's the format I want for the numbering of the items. There you go. There you go. Done it. That's fine. Done it. Done it. Done it. This is excellent. This is excellent. So all you then need to do is to just copy as it is, like this. Copy and go and open it. Go and paste in your Microsoft. Paste. There you go. It's there. So but then to format it further, you just come to uh, design. Go to design. Design here, and then click on your table. Design click on the table to format it within the table. Okay, so so that is that, and you're good to go, and you're good to go. So, so that is that. the same way we're going to copy all other ones, are even more simpler than this. So, 
please if you have not subscribed to our youtube channel try to subscribe and give us thumbs up so that other people will have the opportunity to see it to know that you appreciate this uh, video and uh, if you have any comments put it in the, in the apple so questions as well do the same in the chat box in the in the in the comment section uh, so that uh, if you want us to do any video after now let us know please give us information and 